Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate a free Cloudmersive document conversion connector we can use to target and replace strings in our PowerPoint documents. Let's see how this works. We can begin by clicking Create and selecting the Instant Cloud Flow option. We're going to build a quick manually triggered flow so we can have full control over our data in a limited test. On the flow diagram page, let's begin by grabbing a PowerPoint file. We can use a get file content action for that. My file lives in OneDrive, so I'll be using that option. Once we have our file ready, let's add a new action, and then let's type Cloudmersive into the search bar. We'll see a list of Cloudmersive connectors below, and we can scroll down that list until we find the Cloudmersive Document Conversion Connector. Once we find it, let's click See More. Please note that before we can fully access our connector actions, we'll need to authorize our connection with a free tier API key. We can get one of those by registering a free account on the Cloudmersive website, and that will allow us to make up to 800 API calls per month with no commitments. Once we reach the actions list, let's scroll down until we find an action called replace string in a PowerPoint PPTX presentation, and let's click on that once we find it. Within the parameters tab, let's click show all to review advanced parameters. We can start by entering our file content into the first field, or we can alternatively use a file URL in the second field. After that, we simply need to enter the string we want to replace in our PowerPoint document, and we can then enter the replacement string into the final field. This essentially works exactly the same way a control replace action works within the PowerPoint application itself. All iterations of the original string will be replaced with the new one. Now we can finish our flow with a create file action. When it comes time to enter our file content for our new file, we need to select dynamic content labeled output content from our string replacement action. And that's all there is to it. Now we can easily replace content within our PowerPoint files without having to open them. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more Powered Automate tips and demonstrations.